Okay, so it's the second round of Path to Glory and the dwarves are back. They're a bit bigger, a bit better. Um, one of the Vulkites is actually down a guy, um, but that'll be removed when we start. So we've got um, we've got Timu um, sitting there looking for the... Um, oh no, this is Timu. Timu's the, the rune smiter. He's, uh, he's, he's, he can cast prayers and stuff. We've got the Guardians of the Forge, 10 Hearthguard Berserkers, two fives of Vulkite, uh, two tens of Vulkites, and the Battlesmith, who's looking for his icon. So the quest is um, find the artifact, and uh, as soon as we find it, this former Rune Smiter is going to get it. So after the first round, we have reinforced the unit of um, Hearthguard to 10, and we've allied in a gun hauler. And that is now 1,030 points of Fire Slayers. Round two for the Path to Glory. My Stormcast has uh, bulked up substantially. Got a second unit of Secretors added, along with a Celestar Ballista to deal with anything that gets a little too annoying. And completed the quest from last time, so I've added the Everblaze Comet to my repertoire. This all told is 1,095 points, so a good deal higher than the Fire Slayers on the other side. Yeah, so I'll get a Triumph, which will be uh, Indomitable, which is immune to Battleshock. Very good. Cool. Okay, it's Hold or Die, and the Fire Slayers again have took a wrong turn, and they are um, in somebody else's territory. There they are, minding their own business. And these aggressive upstarts have decided they're going to kill. Not content with killing vampires, they're going to kill some good, honest traders from um, Barak Urbaz and Stromback Lodge. So we've got um, on the table, uh, we have uh, Briarton the Black Handed. He's, um, he's, he's there, my, um, my battlesmith. He's there with 10 uh, Hearthguard and a Gun Hauler. Um, and then aggressively bullying him. We've got 10, ten Sequitors and a Lord Arcanum. And then we've got another one over there on some Arcane. Another Encanter. And then we've got five Sequitors here. And what have you got in space? In space I have another unit of five Sequitors and my Celestar Ballista. There they are over there in space. Um, the other half of my army, Harmy, is a, a unit of 10. Um, there it is, sorry, a unit of 10 with Timu. They're in the tunnels. Um, and a unit of, it'll be nine Volkites. So I can bring on mine at the end of my movement phase. Um, I have to bring my tunneling guys on by the end of the third movement phase or else they die get lost. Um, worth noting that both of our quests is to find an artifact and we have to have, we get a point for each each unit in the opponent's territory. Yep. So I need two, because I'm already on one point, somewhere out with the middle, and you're going to need three, ideally, in the middle. In the middle. Excellent. So, but first you get a, a pre-game move. I do. I love this. Uh -huh. That makes it makes me sad. I've got a, what are you doing? That's right up to me bolt. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost like that was the intent. He's a bad egg. <laughs> he is a bad egg. Yeah. So, <laughs> poor fire slayers. Uh, so the fire slayers are going to go first because I get to choose. So we're going to go to a fire slayers. To it was short and sweet hero phase. We both tried to create a command point uh, for our heroic actions. Neither of us are very inspiring. And we've raised the torch that isn't a battle standard, that is a battle standard for plus one to save for fire slayers within range. And we've got movements done. The boat's flown high. It's nine away behind these sequiturs. Um, this unit uh, has come in from reserve. These have moved over. Um, the wee man, um, he's, he's ran and he's got himself on the mystical. Uh, so yeah. 
uh, that's that and we're gonna go to shooting um, yeah oh I didn't use a rune I'm gonna strike a rune hang on right so uh, I used the rune of awakened steel or far sight it was far sight so I'm plus one to hit with these great axes so first off these nine are gonna throw into the sequiturs um, we're looking for fours and we get some and then we're looking for fives uh, we don't get any so now we'll go with the unit of Hearthguard Berserkers, same thing, looking for fours, and we get some fives, two, quiver and shake, no no rend, none of that business. Four up save. Oh, okay, right, <laughs> gun hauler, fire his drill into them, uh, looking for a five or six ideally, nope, but it hits. And then a three, I think it is. Yep. So rend two, I think, for the drill. Nope. Not much damage. It will be three damage, sir. And the carbines are threes and fours. Threes to hit. And fours, nothing. Uh, that is shooting, because my wee man ran. Um, so we're going to go over charges. So the berserkers, um, they're going to get a plus one because of the command trait. Um, for the Battlesmith, for Vorstag. Um, so they get six, seven, eight, nine, which is plenty. Um, I'll roll them both. Uh, this one needing a three. Uh, yes, ten. And then I might as well go with the gun hauler, needing a nine. No. So we'll move them in. We're, in. Um, we're gonna use the special Vorstag command ability, or I think it's a Vorstag command ability for plus one to hit for Berserkers um, wholly within 12, um, which is there. Um, and I'm going to activate the Hearthguard first. So the Hearthguard are going first. Um, I've used the command ability as said. So there's going to be 21 attacks. Um, it's going to be uh, threes and threes. Um, no rerolls or anything. So. Threes. Ooh. That was a hit. That wasn't. That wasn't. And they're not. So, two, four, six, seven at rend one. Four up save. So, I'll fail three. So, six damage. Three, four, five, six, five up ward. Mm hmm. So that's two oh. dead. Ooh. Um, oh. Your activation, sir. Activate the sequiturs. The sequiturs are going to put their remaining attacks into the um, berserkers behind them. The Volkites with no ward save. So, let's clear these. Five attacks, threes and threes. Rend one, two damage each. So, two hits. One wound, rend one. Okay, so, um, I did charge. Oh, I should have done my sling shields when I charged. Never mind, I'll remember that next time. Um, so, five ups. So, it'll be sixes. One? Mm hmm. Nope. Two damage. Two damage, so that will be one dead. Cool. Uh, then they'll go, so there'll be eight left. Yep. Um, okay, yeah. so um, the remaining eight, it's two attacks each, so it'll be threes and threes, plus one though. I forgot the plus one for the um, the last, the last one, so it's twos and threes. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No rend. Three up saves for these. Oof. I feel one. It's one damage. So I get my five up ward. There we go. They're fine. Hee haw. Right, so that's that. Um, I can't fail my battle shock. Oh, and I'm plus one to save as well because of them. I forgot about him as well. Ugh, hmm. oh, you know, I'll learn. Battle shock. I'm fine. 
cool. There we go. Uh, so that is the end of Fire Slayer's turn one. Um, there's no points in this one. It's just by the end you have to kill a certain amount of models, I think. So we're going to go into uh, turn one for the the Stormcast. And I don't think this is going to go well now. So what's happened? I've brought down a comet. Hmm. Uh, so the comet of uh, Cassandora has just crashed in the middle here. I've killed a dwarf, I've wounded another, I've damaged a boat, and I have unfortunately killed one of my own sequiturs. But friendly fire. And and the the man, um the black handed, he's um he's he he passed his mystical save. So he's still staying there on five. This Not is his dead finest yet. hour. It is his finest hour. Yep. Um he's taken the finest hour because yeah, he feels he feels it's now or never. So yeah. We're going to go into Stormcast movement. Yep. Suddenly a little bit more more in the way of enemies. Um, I redeployed here as the Dracoline advanced. Um, unfortunately, the terrain was such that I couldn't get that far. Even though I rolled a one, it's only making it a eight inch charge. A four, sorry. It only makes it an eight inch charge, doesn't it? Yeah. Um, rather than the six, because I couldn't. Yeah, you know what I mean. Um, these sequitors have dropped. Out of the sky, the ballista has. Ah, it looks scary. So we're going into your shooty phase. Yep, Who's we are. Shooting? The ballista is going to shoot at your ironclad. Well, I wish it was an ironclad. Whatever. <laughs> your fly booty thing. Oh, I feel it's, it's a shame, eh? Hmm. Right. So. Feared. It's a shame it's not a monster. Well, it's not. But I'm going to go for rapid fire. Okay. Four attacks, fives and threes, rounds two, one damage. But each hit that I get is d6, I believe. Yeah. Fives. Just the one. Just the one, but it's d6. Oh. So it is one hit. It wounds at least. Rend. Rend two. Six. Oh. There you are. There we go. Cling. More shooting? No more nope. shooting? That's it. Charges. Right. Let's go for the Lord Arcanum first. Okay. She has a native reroll to charge for going on a Dracoline. So okay. I need an eight. I said, I won't say this again, I need an eight. That's a five. I'm going to attempt to charge with the sequiturs. Need a nine. That's a three. Command point being spent. Command point reroll. I need a nine. Nope. That's a six. <laughs> Yay! Do I charge with your ballista? <laughs> no, not particularly. Hmm. No. So there we go. It wasn't the finest, finest hour, but it was a finest hour nonetheless. <laughs> He managed to stumble with grace off the terrain. <laughs> there you go. So, priority then. Uh, combat phase. Oh, combat phase. Oh, sorry. I'm getting ahead of myself. There he is. So, I'm going to put the uh, power into weapons. Okay. So I get reroll hits. Cool. I'm going to spend a command point for all out attack. Cool. And I'm going to put all three of my attacks into the uh, Volkite. The Volkites. So they will spend a command point for all out defense. Yep. May as well. Twos and threes, re rolling field hits, round one, two damage. Cool. Three hits. Yep. Three wounds. Rend one. So I have a feeling because I was stupid and I redeployed, I am now not wholly within 12. Therefore, I only get plus one. So I'll be on my my five up save because I no longer get the, the extra plus one for the battlesmith. Oh, I'll take that though. Yeah. Happy days. 
Um, so yeah, I shall pile in with the half guard. Yes. We decided that he could just depart. <laughs> there was a lot of a lot of axes pointing at him. So, so there he goes. Um, uh, I lost one. Um, I don't think I don't think that's enough. I believe there are seven. They are sevens, so they can't run. But we have a priority. This comes off because it's no longer his finest hour. Ooh. Yes. He's going to take it, I'm assuming. I'm going to take it. Oh, dear. It's no longer your <laughs> finest hour. <laughs> Black hand. Black hand. Hero face was short and sweet. What have you done? So, uh, Lord Arcanum has generated a command point, which will be good for thumping a banner bearer in a minute. Uh, I've managed to successfully cast Azerite Halo on the big unit of sequiturs and Flaming Weapon on the Lord Arcanum's uh, Aether Staff. Uh, yeah. And a Volkite Berserker has rallied. And that's that. So we're going into movement. Movement phase is done. The ballista's staying where it is. It's going to shoot the boat again. He's he's redeployed. He's got a little bit closer. They're at least within 12 now. Not that they're going to need the plus one save. It's more for him. Um, but yeah, it's, it's not looking great. Um, the whole arm is... Uh, Closing the ground. They, they are victimising him, to be fair. Very much so. He's the smallest model on the board, and you know. But there we go. Uh, shooting. Yes. Four shots, needing fives to hit the boat. Oh, okay. Nothing. Oh, good. That was good. Yeah. I like that. Yeah, it's all right. <laughs> Is there an alternative shot where you do precision as opposed to scatter? Well, yes, but... What's the point? What's the point? Why, why would you? It's only one <laughs> shot with that one. Yeah. You didn't dispel the comet either. No. No. I'm not going to dispel it either. I like it being there. But yeah, so charges. Needing a six with the big man. I get eight. an eight this time. He's so in. She's just going to get to there. I'm unleashing hell. Oh, good for you. <laughs> Why not? It's my last command point. Um, so there's ten half guard berserkers. Um, let me just so check. So the rune, the rune still gives them plus one. Um, so that negates the minus one. So here it comes, fives and fives. Get ready for this. That's three hits. Get ready. Nothing. Nothing. Best command point spent all game. <laughs> Next charge. Um, they ran. Oh yeah, they ran, so they won't be in range. Yeah, so there's nothing else that's in range. Cool. Well, these could charge round, I suppose. Nah. No. They're all right there. They're digging. Okay, they're digging. Um, I've used all my command points like a numpty, so I can't even all out defense. <laughs> um, but I have got my my flag in the air, so mm -hmm. I'm plus one for that. Uh, nice. I'm going to all out defense. Oh, okay. I, well, it's when you picked as a target as an attack, but yeah. Yeah. Do you not want to just kill him and all that attack him instead? Uh, that's the thing. I don't get any benefit from it. Oh, okay. I already hit him too. You so. won't get any from all out defense because he's he's a lover, not a fighter. <laughs> <laughs> Four attacks. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, actually, no. At the start of the combat phase, I'll spend the command point to get plus one to wound. Of the wound. Nice. The Astral Templars specific one. Cool. Four attacks, twos and twos, range one, <laughs> D3 plus one damage. <laughs> Holy moly! Dead boy. Uh -huh. All hit. All wound. Mm -hmm. What's the rend? Rend one. Rend one, so he's a five, down to a four, back up to a five. Four. Uh, three go through. Five wounds, badge. Oh look. Four, five, six, seven, eight wounds. Oh, oh he's got eight eight shrugs. Here it goes. I only need three six four sixes out of eight dice. You ready? Two is not enough. He's gone. He will be back unless I roll something really bad. So there you go, sir. You yep. kill him. Murdered. It's a bad 
egg and I have nothing left to strike back with. So we're gonna go to Fire Slayer's turn two. Hero phase. Yeah, no command point for me, no heroes. No heroic action for me, no heroes. You get one command point and you generate another one. Exactly. Yeah, you failed to dispel the comet. Um, so we're going into my movement. I'm going to strike the rune of relentless zeal. So I get plus two to move. And I get plus two to charge. And I get plus one to charge for Vorstag if I'm near a hero. Oh no, I think it's just plus one anyway. But yeah, it just means I can I can move my little legs and run further away from you. <laughs> so here we go. Let's oh. see there. Movement has been had. We've we've redeployed slightly. Um we've just we 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 get yeah, we're adopting a better position. Look at this, it's looking good. So we're uh yeah, we didn't get quite as far as we would have liked with the half guard. They only rolled a one or a two for their run. Um the Vulkites got quite far though. Um as Eric said, um Eric with his tactical acumen, I should maybe have used those to screen the half guard because they're the ones he's trying to kill. But that'd take strategic thinking. Um the gun haul has moved back a bit as well. It's going to try and kill a ballista. Um, and that's that. The end of the movement phase. Um, Timo and co are staying, staying in the ground. Because they're coming on looking for an artifact next turn. So we're going to shoot. And we're going to shoot a ballista with a drill. Looking for a 5 or a 6 ideally. Uh, no, we miss. 3s and 4s I believe with the carbines. Uh, yeah, 1 at rend 1. Five up, say. Nope. Two damage, is it? Or is it? Oh, it's one for the gun hauler, two for the frigate. Yeah, there you go. Fear it. Um, and then we're going to charge with the boat. Just one damage, oh, you, could, oh, you could stand and shoot, couldn't you? No, I can't. Why? No unit leader. And one of the uh, things I was checking is it's not an elite uh, model either, so you can't issue orders to itself. Yeah, uh, I need a three. Get a seven. Was that me? That was your triumph. Oh. <laughs> Triumphant. Right, so they've charged in. Uh, um, beginning of the combat phase, I'm going to drop bombs. Yes, for one mortal wound. And then I'm going to attack you. Two. Four boarding weapons, fours and fours. Oh, look at them. These KO know what they're doing. The merchants. Three, no rend. Four up save. I feel two of them. Two damage. <coughs> Your activation. And I get four attacks with my um, Sigma right blades, fours and fours. Three hits, one wound, no rend, four up, no, one damage, Fix it. four taken, six to go, you can shoot them, shoot them, uh, so that is the end of my turn two, um, it's all to play for, I already, <laughs> oh no, <laughs> <laughs> oh no, Oh, who's going to get the guy who's going? Oh, I'm going. I got two command points. Can't do anything with them. No heroic action. What are you doing? I got two command points. Heroic action was to generate a command point. I successfully cast Flaming Weapon and got rid of my Comet, so I can drop it on his heed later. Mm, happy days. We're going into Stormcast movement. Movement's been had. The Draculines advanced with purpose. The Hearthguard have redeployed with a five. So the Draculines need an 8 inch charge. The Encant has moved up, now able to issue commands to the Ballista. So, shooting. Is this all out attack? All out attack. Mm. And I'm going to rapid fire right into your uh, wee gun hauler. So I now hit on fours. One hit. Sorry, I'm not laughing. <laughs> Does two hits. 
At least Oof. they both wouldn't. Rend two. Rend two. Sixes. Come on. Oh, takes two. Ooh, yeah. he's only got four left. Fly high, little boat. <laughs> Fly high. <laughs> there he goes. Oof. So, charge phase. Charge phase. I need an eight to get my uh, Lord Arcanum into combat with the Hearthguard. That's a six. I have a native reroll. That's an eight. Oh no! Yes. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Am I after one leash? Oh no, they can't unleash hell. It's got a wrong unit. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Well, they can, but they've redeployed so they can't. Mm. Although, no. I'm going to save it. Uh, why can't they if they redeployed? Because if you've chosen one unit to redeploy, that unit can it's unleash hell later oh, just in that turn. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. Uh, yeah, that's it for my charges. At the beginning of the combat, I drop a bomb. Come on, do it, do it. No! <laughs> And do I? It'll be funny. Nothing's gonna be. No, there's nothing funny about this fight. There was a bit of Benny Hill going on. So that is a full unit of ten, is it? It is in four full unit of ten. Yes. With only a six up ward. With only a six up ward. Okay, I'm gonna shatter three spirit flasks. Oh, don't do that. That's a bad thing to do. So I take three mortal wounds. Oh, good. And you take 3d3. Oh. Take five, five. wounds. Uh, so five six ups. Come on. Come on. Come on, little piggies. Oof, so I take four. So that's two dead and a wound carried over. So he already had a wound. And I'll take these two from the back. Ouch. Uh, right. Start of the combat phase. I am all... S yeah, I'll spend the command point for all out defence. All out defence. Um, I think I will all out defence as well, just because um, I need to try and keep them alive. Four attacks, twos and threes, rend one, d3 plus one damage. Cool. They all hit. Nearly all wound. So rend one. Uh, three was it? Three saves. So this will be fives. Two saved. Take four damage. Four. Oof. Sixes. Oh dear. That's another two dead. Uh, two it was, wasn't it? Oof, crikey. And then three attacks with the monstrous claws. Mm. Twos and threes, rend one, and they are doing d3 damage this turn because I made a charge move. Mm. So, all hit. Mm. Two. Two saves, rend one. So fives. One goes through. Take three damage. Oh, stop it. No. Oh, I only take oh, one, nice. but it's enough to kill a guy. Because that was my floating wound. You've done bad things. <sighs> four. So, two, four, plus one. Threes and threes. I don't get any extra stuff, because why would I? So, threes. Threes. Uh, three at rend one. Three, three up saves. Pass them all. Bugger. Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have gone with the boat. It's your turn. Oh, Going yep. for the boat. Four attacks, fours and fours, no rend, one damage. All hit. Mm. Three wounds. Three fours. Uh, they all pass. Yep. So he'll go uh, fours and fours. Uh, one, no rend. Four up. No. 
Still alive. Just. Just. I am going to spend my triumph to make them immune to battle shock. Okay. And we're going to go into Fire Slayer's turn three. Yep. Ru the Rune of Searing Heat. Uh, sixes to wound are going to do plus one damage, but I won't be in combat because combat's for fools. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. Uh, you recovered, got two back. Yep. I don't get any of that business. So we're going to go to my move. Time. Look, here he comes. Timu's come. He's brought his ten mates. Um, the nine away. The half guard have retreated. Oh, I forgot to retreat the boat. But the boat's going to stay. It's going to have a fight. Uh, so yeah, there we go. Um, we're going to go to shooting. Um, the boat will go first. Um, needs a five or a six, ideally. Nope. Hits. Wounds. Ren 2. Six up save. No. This might be the end of it. Just one. Oh, still there. And then carbines, threes. And fours. No. Crying out loud. Uh, so shoot in with uh, this unit. Basically only four of them are going to get to shoot. You ready for this? Fives. Fives. Yep, missed. Uh, charges. Uh, this unit needs a six. They get a three. Good job. <laughs> uh, this unit needs a nine. They get an eight. Good job. Oh, they've got a horn. There he is. That's Choo -choo. plus one. They're in. Um, so yeah, happy days. Um, we charge, so I think we do mortal wounds. So they're in. They did three mortal wounds on the charge. Everybody else is watching. I don't have any command points, so I can't buff them. Um, but, yeah, I think I am going to go with them first. Um, so, yeah, are you going to spend anything? I'm going to attack your Arcanum guy. All out defence. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's see if we can get anything through. Okay, so there's no heroes doing stuff. So um, it's just going to be threes and threes. Mm. But sixes do double damage. So three for two damage. And six at one damage. Let's see it. Twos to save. So your three double damage. All passed. Mm. And your six regular damage. Oh, oh, I see three ones. Yeah, I think that is her dead, actually. Oh, nobody expected that. No. Yeah, S only seven wounds. Sling shields. And in. Oh, the, well. the horn for the cheeky plus one to charge. Happy days. We did it. Look at that. But your ballista now gets to go into the gun hauler. The gun hauler's got four left. So I would need all hits, all wounds, all, hits, all wounds and you fail all saves. So three hits. One save. No rend. Pause. Oh, I get to drop a bomb on you as well. Oh, yeah. Um, I'll try and save this first. Yeah, save it anyway. Yeah. But then on a four up. Yep. Dead. Oh, so it didn't attack me anyway. It took three. Yep. Look at that. Nobody expected that kind of turnaround, did they? <laughs> right. Here we go. I really want to get priority because I don't want a comet falling there. <laughs> That'll do horrible things. Ooh, and I do. You so I believe I am going to take it. Um, and we're going to spread ourselves out a little. Um, so I'm going to get one command point for going first. And I'm going to spend it straight away. Oh, uh, for my heroic action, Timu's going to try and generate one. He does. And Timu's going to... Oh, what do you want to do for your heroic action? Same. Generate command point. And I get it. Yep. Um, oh. So I'm going to use my free command point to rally the six half guard come on 
Give me a six. Oh, I'll take four sixes. <laughs> so though they planned it all along. Yeah, movement's done. We're going to try and get rid of that Arcanum because that's the thing that can drop a Comet on us. So we've shuffled over. These ran. Timu ran one. Um, they just moved and they just moved. Uh, there's been a redeploy for the Arcanum. So we're going to do some shooting. Um, so the drill. That's three mortals. No. no. I'm all out defensing for all the difference that's going to make. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and then threes and fours for the uh, carbines. I'm aware that now you've rolled for, was it three mortals? Yeah. I'm aware now you've done that, all out defense doesn't really make any difference, but I do have to declare as it's a target. Yeah. Um, so that's missed. I'm just going to measure. Um, don't think anybody's in range. Uh, no, they can't throw. So that is shooting. Um, so we've got charges. Yep. It's going to be a nine inch charge here. Seven. Uh, does your plus one from Volstar stack with your horn? Oh, it that's does. A good point. It does. Yeah. So that'll that'll work then. Yeah. Thanks, Eric. Sorry. Sorry, Smudge. Uh, so, four, six, eight, ten. Sling shields. Oh, I'd forgotten about them. One mortal. Still there. Yeah. Still standing. Uh, the gun hauler will charge. Six, is that enough? Six is enough. Yeah, I'll just go in. So do you get the plus one to charge for allied units? No. No. Oh, it's five. Yeah. Sorry. I just can't count. Yeah, five's not enough. No, no. I don't. Uh, happy days. I could have done with that being in. I'm going to... I can't command point it because I've got no hero within range. So I'm not going to command point that. So yeah, that is me. So going into combat... Um, I will, I'm not going to all out anything. I'm just going to attack you. All out defense again. Okay. Because I can do that with it being different phases, can't I? Uh, yep. Yeah, you can, yeah. Yeah. So I'll do these bits here first. So I'm looking for threes and threes. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine at rend one. Oh. It's worth a try. Dead. Oof. There it goes. That was an incredibly risky thing for you to do. I honestly hadn't expected that. What? Well, if you hadn't killed that, uh -huh. you probably would have just given me the game there when you didn't really need to. Well, I was just a bit concerned that you'd roll good with the the Comet, and I don't think I could have spread them apart enough that you couldn't get the bulk of the army with the Comet. And I, I've only got four wounds on that, which you could... I mean, I could have put it right in the corner, I suppose. I, I could have just needed, run them away. I'd have needed a six followed by a four up in order to get the game that way mm. so but yeah yeah that's that's my go all done uh and we're gonna go into um turn four yep uh, uh you're fine chaps <clears throat> i'm gonna go for a command point yep yep and i'm gonna i'm gonna rally straight away with it well when it's I'll do it now. Yeah. Yep, get another one. That's good. Okay, so over to you, sir. Right. So at the end, um, what we've basically done there for the bottom four, um, the Stormcast consolidated the center to find their special magic stick um, for the Hunt the Quest, the artifact. And then for turn five, 
um, the fire slayers are going to go searching for the, um, the icon of the ancestors in the corners. And at that point, we call things there. So yep. how does that work? What's um, the outcome? You get major win. Stu. Because I have two of my because starting you army left. Kill half of your starting force. Yep. Cool. So we'll do our aftermath stuff and see what happens. Okay, this is the aftermath for game two against Stu. Uh, unfortunately, my Stormcast got a little battered in the last one, so the Companions of Hope, one of my units of five Sequiturs, suffered a casualty, and Heria the Worthy, my Knight in Canter, suffered a wound. Heria the Worthy was my MVP for the last battle. Uh, no one earned enough uh, glory to earn a rank, uh, because my secretaries are in the middle searching for the staff, I completed that quest. So I've got that added to my roster, and now I have started a quest to hunt down the Emerald Life Swarm. And here it is, the aftermath phase, and a chicken dog. Look, we've retired to a different room. Here we are. So, what have we got? Ooh, skills. So, we scored. The Fire Slayer's got eight glory. Um, I had a major injury to um, the black-handed Brighton. Um, he's minus one wound um, when he starts the next game that can't be negated or healed. Um, my favoured warriors, I chose the half guard. Um, they got um, a five, I think it was, for the renown extra. So they went up a rank. They became veterans. So the guardians of the forge... Um, I've now got a defensive formation as a veteran ability. We found the artifact, so we've acquired the um, the icon of the ancestors. Um, we didn't get any territory. We didn't have enough glory left. We spent all of our glory on a bar barracks, five points, which means that we can recruit some more, more troops. We've got three glory left, but we're saving up for another gun hauler. Um, and then we've began the qu the begun the quest to defend the realm, um, which gets us ten glory. Look, the chicken dog. Oh, she leapt. Look at her. She's pounced onto a sofa. Um, and then that's that really. Um, so that is the end of round two. We didn't get any more troops. Um, there we go. Join us for uh the second half of round two, where the ogres will fight against um against the uh, the Vengorians, the Avangori, and then it will be Avangori versus Fire Slayers and Ogres versus Stormcast in round three.